your windows 11 might look fine but what if i told you it's secretly slowing itself down today i'll show you step by step manual optimization no third party tools just pure setting tweaks that make your pc run like new so let's get started before we start optimizing i strongly suggest creating a restore point that way if something doesn't work as expected later you can roll your system back to the exact moment no harm done problems are rare but it's always smart to play it safe so first go to windows search and type restore then open create a restore point now click create if the create button is grayed out then select your c drive and then click configure after that select run on system protection to enable it now click create then name it win11 optimization next click on create now wait a moment windows will now create the restore point once you see the confirmation message click close and you are done this is just like having a safety net before making changes Search indexing constantly runs in the background to speed up file searches. But if you rarely use File Explorer search, it's just eating CPU and disk resources for no reason. Turning it off can free up system performance. So first, go to Windows Search and type Services. Click on it. Now scroll down to find Windows Search. After that double click on Windows search. Now set startup type to disabled. Then click stop. Now click on apply and then okay. First startup sounds good, but it's like half shut down. Over time it can cause driver issues and slower performance after long use so press windows plus r now type powercfg.cpl and then press enter now go to create a power plan now select high performance it's optional for laptops if battery is important now here you have to type the name of the plan name i'm naming it high performance here click on next then click on create now click choose what the power buttons do now click on uncheck settings that are currently unavailable then uncheck turn on first startup and click save animations look nice but use extra resources So we will keep only the useful ones. Press Windows plus R and type sysdm.cpl and then hit enter. Now go to advanced. Now under performance go to settings. Now select adjust for best performance. And then tick animations windows when minimizing or maximizing. Show thumbnails instead of icons. smooth edges of screen fonts now click apply and then click okay if you have 2 to 16 gb ram increasing virtual memory can help when multitasking if you have more than 16 gb you can skip this so go to windows search and type advanced system settings click on it So first go to performance options then go to advanced after that go to virtual memory now change uncheck automatically manage then select your c drive next click on custom size virtual memory settings initial size equals take your ram in mb and multiply by 1.5 and maximum size equals take your ram in mb and multiply by 3 now i have opened the calculator here so i can explain it better for example if you have 8 gb ram 
since each RAM equals 1024 MB. So 8 GB RAM is 8192 MB. So initial size will be 8192 multiply 1.5 equals 12288 MB. And maximum size will be 8192 multiply 3 equals 24576 MB. Now click set and then click OK. Now as you can see the committed size has changed. Background access to location, mic and camera, waste resources and battery. Press Windows plus I to go to settings. Then go to privacy and security. Under Windows permissions go to disable things like speech, typing personalizations, diagnostics and feedback. Now under app permissions click on disable unused access for locations, camera, microphone etc. If you play games on your PC, you should enable game mode in Windows. Game mode tells Windows to prioritize system resources for your game, reducing background activity and giving you more stable FPS while you playing. This helps avoid sudden frame drops or stutters. So first go to settings. Now go to gaming. Then click on game mode. Now enable game mode. After that, disable Xbox Game Bar. It runs in the background. Transparency effect look nice, but use GPU resources. So first, open settings. Then go to accessibility. After that, go to visual effects. Now turn off transparency effects. Turning off transparency effects reduces GPU load, improving performance and responsiveness, especially on low-end PCs. Under settings, go to system. Then go to display. Now scroll down and click on advanced display. Now choose highest refresh rate. If your monitor supports it, then higher refresh rates give smoother visuals. Windows Auto Clean isn't always accurate. We will do it ourselves. Under settings, go to system. Then click on storage. After that, turn off storage sense. Now press Windows plus R to open run dialog box. Now type percent %10% percent and hit enter. Now delete all these files. Don't worry, these are just temporary files, so it's safe to delete them all. After that, again press Windows plus R. Now type temp and hit enter. Now delete these files also. This helps free up space and improve system performance. Hibernation mode more takes up gigabytes of space. So first go to Windows search. Type CMD. Now click on run as administrator. Now type powercfg.exe space forward slash hibernate space off and hit enter. And now as you can see my hibernation mode is off. Now your PC will boot quicker, run smoother and feel much faster overall. So that's it for today. If you found this tutorial helpful then please give it a like, share and subscribe our channel for more tech tutorial and fixes.
थैंक यू थैंक्स फॉर वाचिंग